Scorpio, welcome, welcome, welcome to your channel, you guys. We're going to do your mini reading to see what's going on with you on your person, Scorpio. Welcome, welcome, you guys. I just came from work and I was like, I got it. I want to do my readings. You know, this is like my joy, you know, so here I am. So I hope you guys are doing very well on this Wednesday. By the time this goes up, though, it'll be Wednesday night. <laughs> Oh my goodness, you guys. Please like this video if it resonates. Remember, by liking the video, YouTube sees that you like it. Push the videos forward into a bigger audience so the video can grow, so the channel can grow, okay? And you guys have been doing really good so far, so thank you, thank you in advance if you did do that. Um, also, Scorpio, thank you guys for supporting your girl. So we're almost at four. 15,000 subscribers so thank you so much and also you guys might hear my cats crying okay and because I just made it home and you know they are just want mommy's attention so it is what it is all right angel Scorpio please if it doesn't resonate you guys I'll have the link in the below section of this video let me get into your energy Scorpio Okay, I'll take it, angels. All right, the first card that came out was the Seven of Wands, Scorpio. We have someone that is very much still fighting for this connection. Here, let me see. I feel like they're still fighting for this connection. There's other people that's tried to get with them, get at them, and letting them know that, hey, you maybe you need to move on from this person. But I see in the Seven of Wands, like this person is still so passionate, protective over this connection. This person is not yet ready to give up on this connection, Scorpio. I do feel like the Ten of Pentacles is still in the play here, where this person is still hoping for a happy ending with you. They want a legacy with you also, all right? This is very hard with the Seven of Wands here. Something is holding this person back from really accomplishing this ten of pentacles with you okay i feel like the high priestess is coming through scorpio this is you you're not sure about this connection you're not sure you're going back and forth i feel like you're just going with a great line right now scorpio and trying to figure out and see what happens with this person we have the knight of swords here where some blockage so this person ooh, ah all right so this person, you guys are not talking right now. I feel like you blocked this person is the Knight of Swords. So this is telling me about a year. For some of you, you haven't heard from this person in a year. It could be eight months, nine months. It could be two months. But it's months to a year, okay? This person has been watching you, Scorpio. Watching you, watching you, watching you. They want to come towards you with this Knight of Cups, but they're not doing it. They want a second chance, but they're not sure if it's going to even work out, if you're going to take it. What else? The Seven of Swords. You're going back and forth. I see back and forth here. The Wheel of Fortune, the King of Cups. Ooh. So this is a cycle between you, but the cycle have ended. Someone have ended this relationship. The lesson have ended. I feel like you, you two were supposed to learn something from each other, but the lesson have ended here, okay? And then here is this person coming in with this King of Cups here. A more stable, long-term commitment that this person wants to give you. Let's see what's going on. All right. Oh, oh my God. So we have the Eight of Cups here. We have the Two of Cups. And we have the Queen of Cups in reverse. Scorpio, you have left someone here. This soulmate, this person wants to come back to you and reunite with you. If you guys are not together, I feel like you're not they're together. You're just not. Somebody walked away from somebody in the Eight of Cups here, chose their own destiny here. In the Two of Cups, this person wants to get back to you. This person is like thinking about you so much in this Queen of Cups. You're on their mind, Scorpio. You're on their mind to the point that they can't even, they can't even get their shit together. Angels, what else do you have for Scorpio? Ugh. 
this person was a manipulative person in the emperor. Very manipulative, very controlling. Probably a fire sign, you guys. Very controlling energy, okay? This person lied to you, betrayed you, left you in the dark. I feel like they, this person had so much going on, so many secrets. And they lied to you. Every time you felt something wasn't right and you asked them about it, they can they try to control the, narr or the narrative in this situation. I feel like for some of you, they even try to control you. You know? This person is a very controlling, selfish person in their own way. Probably physically and mentally abused you for some of you. And I also feel like they, they want to come back. I feel like you feel stuck. For some of you, you're still like... You don't know if you want to leave this person because it's a strong pull in this two of uh, cups here. You can't stop thinking about them as well, Scorpio, because this two of cups talks about soulmate connection, mutual feelings. Whatever this person is feeling, you're feeling it too. You want to move on with your life, but for something is holding you back. You're like, why? Why this person? I see the six of pentacles where someone wants to come back and give balance. Then we have the knight of wands, passion, but no confidence in themselves. Oh, the devil, the high fronts in the upright, not the upright in the reverse, actually. Then you have the magician in the back. Oh, my goodness. We have the devil here. So this person could be stuck in something. Oh, angels want me to say this, too. We have the page of swords and the queen of wands. There's going to be communication, but this person is just very immature, might be a high and a buy, might be a high and a buy, I feel like in the queen of wands, I feel like this person, likes being around you, Scorpio, they like it, they're very passionate towards you, you know, I I feel like you, they think that you guys could be good together in the Queen of Wands. I feel like this person has a lot of secrets. For some of you, this person is already married to someone or living with someone. Could be a baby mama, baby, baby daddy drama. We have the moon here. This person has made a mistake. What mistake they, they have made, angels? Please clarify the moon. What, does, what was the mistake? What was this mistake, please? Oh, three cards. All right, the four of wands, the three of wands, letting you go. The four of pentacles, not cherishing you, not taking you out, not buying you things. They wanted a happy ending with you. They wanted abundance. They wanted a marriage. They let, they let you down. They let you down, Scorpio. We have the death. This person still wants to be with you, though. Only you. Only you, Scorpio. Oh, my God. I'm going to leave this here because this is your mini reading, you guys. But just watch out because this person is watching you. You probably don't even know. Probably in your parking lot. Probably on your social media. This person is watching to see what's what. They do want to come in and apologize, but it's just not the right time for them for some reason because of what they have done. I feel like this person have been separated from you for like a year or it could be just 10 months it could be 12 months it could you know what i'm saying it could be two months it's months with this knight of swords so let's leave it here if it resonates you guys like this video and i'll see you guys in your full reading bye guys